Bro, I just found the masjid and it's low-key in such a creepy place. Look at this, bro. This is kind of low-key creepy, bro. This is scary as hell. I'm entering this place. Let's see what there is. Yo, what's up guys? I'm Aikum. Welcome back to another vlog. How you guys doing, bro? Bro, before I start with anything, let me just give the shout out so I don't forget. There you go. There's my new video. Three, two, one. There you go. Oh my god, it landed between two people. Uh, Alright, then let me give a shout out to both of them. What's your name? Ruh Yaz. Shout out to you. And Zayn Shafi, shout out to you. Anyway, now that we got the shout out out of the day, I don't have to worry about forgetting it. So let me tell you guys what we're about to do today. My family already went out. They went to, you know, they went to enjoy the weather. By the way, it was raining today. The weather was so good. And now it's back to being sunny. That's the irony about the weather here, bro. Like you can literally never predict it. What am I doing today, guys? So check this out. I have a football match in about three hours, okay? And I don't have any football shoes. And if you guys remember what happened last time when I tried to go get football shoes, the shops were closed. So right now the shops are open i'm gonna go to the city buy myself football shoes get all ready for the match inshallah inshallah we win bro it's a match against uh, another team Acha. and they're pretty strong as well so yeah inshallah we win and by the way they're grown men okay i'm i'm a, I'm a little kid so even if we lose it's not my fault it's my other teammates fault you know <laughs> anyway bro let's get ready and uh go towards the city let me quickly get my phone and let's get my wallet Oh, yo, it's so hot. My wallet is like the sun right now. I put it over here and the sun is so hot. It literally melted my wallet. Guys, and bus finally made it here on time, bro. Literally, I haven't even waited for two seconds and the bus is finally here. Let's go inside and go to the city. Alright guys, I finally made it to the city. Check this out bro, there's not a lot of people outside because it's not a weekend, you know, it's weekday, everyone's working. I'm walking over to the shop, it's very far away bro, I think it's like about a kilometer away. So yeah, it's gonna take me a long time, so I'll see you guys once I get to the shop. Bro, after walking for like one kilometer or something, I finally made it to the store, this is it right here. Let's go inside, let's check out their shoes. We gotta go upstairs because downstairs are all for ladies, you know. Whew, yo, first glimpse at the shoes, they look pretty dope. Which one should I get? Um, First we gotta check the price because bro, if it's too expensive, I don't mind playing barefoot. Oh, 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 oh. They're like 240 something like that. So yeah, they're good prices. It's not that expensive. We can buy it, bro. We can afford it. It's fine. Yo, they have some other ones over here as well. These ones look better than the ones over there. I feel like trying this one out, but then I'm so confused. You know when there's so many options to choose from? You have no idea which one to get. Bro, I just have no idea which one to get. There's so many. All right, bro. I checked this shoe out right here and I really liked it. So I'm gonna get this one. This is 39, by the way. It's not 40. 40 was a bit too big for me. Guys, the shoe that I was about to buy, my size wasn't there. Unfortunately, bro. It's kind of what a day it is. So I'm getting this one right here. This is the only 39 shoe size that they found. So this is the one that I'm getting. So I got my shoes. Let's go back home quickly, wear it, and go to the shoe. I mean, go to the football match. Five minutes later. Guys, I finally made it back home, but I have to get ready quickly and go downstairs because we're getting late for the football match. And that sun was so bright, bro. It almost made me go blind. Check this out. Yo, I can't even open my eyes. Anyway, so these are my shoes right here. Check that out right there. And uh, let me quickly wear my stuff and get ready, you know. I packed my bag and everything. Net. Let's go downstairs, bro. What's the time right now? 6.46. So I'm about, you know, it's about the same time. Anyway, bro, I got all ready, as you guys can see. Now I'm about to go to the match. Congratulations. You played yourself. Guys, huge change of plans. Let me tell you what happened, bro. So I was about to leave, okay? And then I get a message from the person who organized the match and everything. He tells me the other team canceled the match. Oh, hell no. And then he told me, let me see if we're gonna play in between ourselves, you know, the Uzbeks. And then after that, my dad is like, I'm going to Istanbul, do you want to come with me? So, bro, I guess the match is gone, you know? So, I'm just going with my dad right now, bro. The other team canceled the freaking match. Damn, bro. Come on, kill them. Anyway, bro, let's go to Istanbul. Guys, my dad just sat in the passenger seat, so I guess I'm gonna be driving. Yo, my sister was the last one to drive, and the seat is so front. Let me pull it back a bit. Anyway, guys, I'll see you guys. I'll see you guys once we reach Istanbul. We made it to Istanbul. I came. Me and my dad came here to my dad's friend's restaurant opening. He made a new restaurant over here. So let's go check that out. And the weather here is just beautiful, mashallah. Guys, I just met with my dad's friend and all. And mashallah, their restaurant, bro. Look at this. Such a beautiful big restaurant, mashallah. It's very big and. <laughs> but guys, I'm about to call up my friends, Yasin and Yusuf, see what they're up to. And if they're free, we can link up, you know? Let's call them. Hey, yo, what's up, bro? Yo, assalamu alaikum, bro. How you doing? What are you up to? Yeah, I'm chilling, bro. Chilling at home or like with some. Oh, at home. Alright, bro, he says he's gonna call me in like five minutes and let me know what's up. Let's see if we're gonna link up or not. Bro, waiting for Yusuf to call back. I'm just sitting outside like a homeless person right now. Look at me, bro. <laughs> Alright, bro, Yusuf just called me. He said uh, his mom is not letting him go. <laughs> 
Poor kid, bro. The thing is, there's some type of teacher coming to his house, so he's not allowed to go out, you know? Anyway, the Maghrib Adhan just said, so I'm gonna go pray in Maghrib. Bro, I just asked someone when was the closest masjid. He said it's inside this building right here where I just exited from. Bro, this is a weird entrance to a building, bro. It looks more like a death trap or something like that. You know, when people go inside and get kidnapped. Bro, what type of an entrance is this? This is creepy as hell. Okay, I see some elevators now. Now I know I'm, I'm safe, it's fine. Bro, I just found the masjid and it's low-key in such a creepy place. Look at this, bro. Look, you walk in through that door, okay? There's a bunch of doors right here. That's where the masjid is right there, bro. This is kind of low-key cre creepy, bro. This is scary as hell. I'm entering this place. Let's see what there is. Okay, this is the, this is the men's side. This is the women's side. Bismillah. That was scary as hell. Okay, there's nothing here. Let's quickly pray and then we'll go back out. Bro, they put this masjid in such a quiet, low-key place. It took me like 10 minutes to find it, bro. It was like a maze. I don't even have wudu. Let's go make wudu. These washrooms are so scary, bro. I'm low-key tripping out, bro. I don't even feel like making wudu right now. You know what? Let's just do it quickly. Alright, bro. I just did my wudu. Let's go back and pray. Oof. Alright, guys. I'm gonna see you guys. See you guys in 3, 2, 1. Alright, bro. I'm done praying. Now let's go back upstairs. Let's turn off the lights. Bro, creepy place, bro. Who puts a masjid in here? Once you walk out of that place, you enter a parking lot. Like, this parking lot's creepy as hell as well. Imagine I see a murder taking place, and then the killer sees me. He's like, you've seen way too much, and he starts chasing me to kill me as well. Bro, I'm, what am I thinking, bro? I've seen way too many movies, bro. Guys, I just came to a restaurant to eat some burger because I haven't had lunch. The outside is completely empty, so I can have myself whichever seat I want. So there's a cheeseburger, there's the Anadolu burger, there's the Atomics burger, there's a bacon burger. I don't know if that's halal. Is that halal? Imagine they're selling haram stuff here, and then I eat it, bro. I'm just kidding guys, don't worry, it's not it's not pig bacon, it's uh, it's beef bacon, so don't worry. Look at that police golf cart, bro. Uh, that, that thing is cute as hell, bro. I wouldn't even be scared if it pulled me over. You are my honey bun sugar plum. Oh my god, cute little police officers, bro. My burger finally made it here. Look at this, bro. It looks so good. It looks so cute, bro. Yo, the inside of this burger looks amazing, bro. Look at that. Let me try it out as well. Bismillah, bro. Bro, this is dope. This is amazing. Anyway, bro, I finished eating. My stomach is about to burst out. Otherwise, I would have finished these as well. Guys, we're quickly checking out the wedding hall that's over here in this uh, terrace place right here. Yo, mashallah, bro. Check this place out, bro. This wedding hall. Bro, this is the best wedding hall I've seen ever since we came to Turkey. Let's see what there is in, in here, right here. There's a kitchen right there. Yo, what in the world, bro? I thought that was it. There's another big wedding hall right here. Masha'Allah, bro. Guys, check this out, bro. This staircase right here looks like the staircase to heaven, but then it only ends after like six, seven steps. Yo, look at how big this chandelier is, bro. Imagine a family's having their dinner over here at a wedding and the chandelier just falls on them, bro. What a haram, you? Thing just started beeping. What is this? Damn, sounds like a time bomb. Guys, they just activated the lights. Oh, yo, this is a nightclub right here, mashallah. Check this out, bro. It's another one. Oh my god. There's another wedding hall, bro. There's a total of three wedding halls here. Yo, this one is even better than the other ones, mashallah. Bro, no joke. Look at this. Look at this table right here, bro. This is where the groom is gonna sit, and this is where the four wives are gonna sit. <laughs> Guys, by the way, if you have, if you have any wedding productions you want to get done, uh, you can contact this guy right over here. By the way, this is the board entrance right over here. The next day. What's up, guys? Now it's the next day, and bro, I don't know why I just keep ending every single vlog on the next day. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, guys. Enjoy the drop like, and I'll see you guys. You guys already know what's up, bro. I don't even say it. I need to, I don't need to say it every single vlog. Just bye.